Hello everybody and welcome back to more Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth gameplay. Hope you guys are having a good one and in this one we are continuing right where we left off here in the Chocobo Farm. We are needing to find a Chocobo to get across the swamp in order to get to Junon. And we are with the full crew. We got Aerith, we got Red, we've got Barret, and of course we've got Tifa. We are ready to continue this amazing story so far. I'm having such a fun time, and I hope you guys are as well. And like always, down in the description will be chapters to help guide you guys along the way. And without further ado, more Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Let's go! Alright, so we are needing to find a chocobo. But in order to do so, we need to find some tracks. Oh, follow the chocobo tracks. Oh, are these the chocobo? Okay, I see them. They're kind of... Subtle. Oh, just follow the feathers. You can follow the feathers as well. There's feathers and the tracks. Luckily, he literally just... Oh, found yeah. it. Come on, y'all. Let's go bag us a chocobo. The one that has armor? Keep it down. When you're on the hunt, you don't want to startle your prey. Prey? You know we're not here to kill him, right? Yeah. So I got a sneak? Wrangling a chocobo. Approach Pico without being noticed. If you're in danger of being spotted by him or one of his pack mates, quickly press circle to roll out of sight. By throwing stones, you picked up L1 and square to throw. Oh, Pico. Okay, I, I gotta go behind it. I have a feeling I gotta go behind it. Without being spotted. Here's the thing, this bird. Don't mind me. I am friendly. Mini game checkpoint updated. So if I fail, proceed when the chocobo's back is turned. Oh, the this music is so perfect for this situation. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Turn around. Turn around. Yes, you are a pretty bird, but turn around. You're not the one I want. Turn around. There we go. Can I roll? Throw a rock behind the bird to get its attention. Aim. Throw. That's a big rock. Alright, then sneak up behind it. And... Go! I think I got it. We got two golden plumes. Is he on our side? Five party experience. Just the cutest? <laughs> you know, they are kind of similar. Totally. <laughs> what does he want now? Do you think maybe he's still hungry? Sorry, that's all the food we had. But you know where there's more? Bill's place. Oh. Back to the ranch it is then. Come on. That music change was unexpected. <laughs> All right. Oh, he's made it back. We also have the plumes. Ah, there's our guy. Nothing beats a little taste of home, now does it? Hmm. Huh. <laughs> Not so much as a feather out of place. Got one healthy bird here. 
enough to ride? Sure. Though I wouldn't try till he's done eating. Once he's at his fill, though, I'm sure he'll come around to the idea, if we ask him nice. Ain't that right? I'll need to prep his gear and all that, so why don't you wait outside? <laughs> Hold on. Uh, we got the plumes. I really can't thank you enough for bringing Pico back to us. So if I trade plumes, okay, so we can get a Shinra avian helmet. <gasps> Look hey who there. it is! What a pleasant surprise! Chadley. You do remember me, don't you? Uh, yeah, you are the person that helps us with training. You have, like, the AI stuff and the computers and stuff. I knew you would. It was an absolute pleasure working with you in Midgar. Thank you again. Your invaluable intel allowed me to create so much materia. Detecting internal monologue. The hell's this weirdo doing here? What? <laughs> I was created by Professor Hojo, you know. Though your thoughts could be read by any cyborg. But, to answer your question, I took a page out of your book and skipped town. Now, the whole world's my laboratory. Speaking of which, I have a favor to ask, if it's not too much trouble. You need more battle intel. That's the cloud I know. Always eager to get on with it. But yes, though, I'd like you to activate some Remna Wave Towers first. They were originally constructed by the Republic of Junon, but were claimed by Shinra after the war. Since which time they've sat idle and untouched, just waiting for someone to put them to good use. The more towers you activate around the world, the more my processing power will grow. As will the area I can survey. I oh. might even be able to construct a communications network independent of Shinra. How does that sound? You'd not only be helping me, but yourselves as well. We find any. We'll turn them on. I, uh, I thought you might say something like that. Let's get started then. See that tower? That's your first target. And this will activate it. A Chad <laughs> module. Towers close by. Allow me to accompany you. You've just acquired a Chad. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I gotta get a drink. You know, this game is just so much fun, I need to drink something. Here we are. Alright, activate. Bringing the world to life. confirmed. Initiating preliminary scan of the grasslands. I'll ascertain the locations of fiends and natural resources. Okay. So we got locations of enemies and resources. After careful consideration, I have devised a new name for this type of research. I call it World Intel. World Intel. Chadley will employ the data you collect to develop new materia, create new combat simulations, and embark on other scientific endeavors. Activate the Remna Wave Towers you encounter and help Chadley deepen your understanding of this world. I hope you'll assist me in gathering relevant data by completing various tasks on your travels. In return, I will use the information you provide to develop new materia. Quid pro quo. To summarize, I want us to become research partners. But before that, is there anything you would like to ask? Uh, I got the... I got, I got everything. Yeah, I get the In gist. That case, I see no reason not to begin at once. With your activation of this tower, my analysis of the grasslands has already yielded some data. Though hardly substantial, it is enough for me to create materia. Which of these would you like? 
Fire and ice materia. Use fire and blizzard at the same time. Auto cast. Morph. An auto unique ability. Allows an ally to automatically use unique abilities when not actively controlled during battle. That will come in handy. How many points do I have? Two? I am going to buy both of those. I think that's it. I wish you all the best in the long journey that lies ahead of you. And remember, you're not in this alone. Should you require assistance, just ask. Just ask. Combat Simulator updates. Complete these challenges during a variety of rewards such as a powerful summoning materia. Similar to uh, the ones in... Oh, we can now assume... Is it okay, so we can summon the Titan. Know the enemy. So the Combat Simulator. All right, so a whole bunch of things just unlocked. All right, so if we go to the map, he has a bunch of things here. So if I talk to you, what? I have recreated Titan, the mythical colossus of the grasslands in virtual space. I encourage you to pit your skills against this summoned entity so that I might complete its materia. So I can take on the Titan? Am I prepared for this or no? I don't know if I'm prepared for this. Level sync. Titan materia. Round one. Team members one, two, three. Okay. Level is synced to you. And merge victorious against these mighty entities in the combat simulator to be rewarded with their summoning materia. When an entity is pr proven to, to you can gain an advantage in battle by analyzing. <laughs> If an entity is proving too difficult, you can gain an advantage in battle by analyzing its corresponding summon crystals found around the world. Oh, I see. So you find their crystals and it makes them easier to fight. This is it at full strength. I don't know if I'm ready for it at full strength. Let's see how this goes. I'm just curious. Who knows? What is that? Ow. I don't have any items. This thing does has a lot of health. Ah. Spells cure. Deal with that. Ah, this is really bad. Okay, yeah, I don't I am not prepared to do this yet. Yeah, the damage on it is not like, we're doing ones and twos here. I wanted to do so yeah. much more. Not possible. Not possible. Just yet. At least we know. Yeah, we are not re-challenging that. Not re-challenging. We, we need to, uh, get him, like, Perhaps lower. You're having an off day. Oh, shut up, Chad. All right, well, let's try this stuff, though. There's some things around here, so let's go... Oh, there's a lot of... Th oh, my God, he released, a he released a lot of stuff. Okay, so there's this right here, so let's see what this is. Hey, perfect timing. Pico's all prepped. But first, here. You just give that whistle a toot, and your chocobo will come a-running. Uh, press R1 to use your chocobo whistle. Okay. So, who here's never been on Chocoback? I haven't. Why don't we take a few laps to get you comfortable then? Come with me. Okay. Practice. Is there a track? Here's where we get our birds in shape for the races. What races? The gold saucers, I mean. They're a big deal in our community. You won't find a ranch around here that doesn't compete. So you guys race too? We've been sitting it out since mom and dad left. But we're gonna get back in the fight soon and kick the tar out of one particularly nasty weasel. But never you mind all that. You just focus on the basics, like making sure you don't get thrown from the saddle. Why don't you try hopping on Pico and giving me a holler? All right, call Chocobo. Okay, but how's about we stretch his legs a bit? Use the training grounds on Bill's ranch to get the hang of chocobo riding. 
R2 is to sprint. Circle is to jump. Oh, we get uh, rewards. Yes. Let's see if we can do this. What the heck? It stops if you run right into it. That is a big slowdown right there. Thirty-three seconds. Oh, I need to get to thirty-one. I would have had it. I can do that again easily. That was something else. You and Pico are a perfect match. Might even have what it takes to win a race or two at the Gold Saucer. Hold on. I can't thank you enough, Billy. <laughs> I gotta do that again. Oh, that reminds me. Y'all mentioned your flat broke, right? Then you might want to swing by Calm again. Now that the troopers have cleared out, it's probably safe for you to ask around for work. Though, don't run off just yet. My sister's looking for help. Not sure what the trouble is. Didn't want to confide in me for whatever reason. Honestly, she hasn't been herself since Mom left. They did dang near everything together. You okay. want to lend Chloe a hand? We need to move on. True, but moving on costs money. True. We had fun helping people in Sector 5, right? Same deal. Side quests. Odd jobs. Got it. Community notice boards. Got it. And fast traveling the world. You can warp to any unlocked waypoints, such as towns, repaired chocobo stops, and activated remna, wear, uh, remna wave towers. Got it. Now we have fast travel. Awesome. Let's do this race again. Gonna practice? Yes, I can clearly get like 31 seconds. I just wanted to get that final reward. I should have gotten it the first time. Wait! Oh! That actually turned out to be really close than what I thought it would be. Got nothing left to teach you anymore. There we go. Good. Done. No. Alright. So, he said that his sister needs help. So, let's go to... Back to his sister. Let's see what's going on. There's so much side stuff to do now. What is that? Is that the... Oh, you can customize the chocobo. Okay. Oh, hey! You're back! I heard you might need some help. You did? Oh, I see. Billy talked to you, didn't he? I've been meaning to go pick flowers, but the planes are way too dangerous for that. I'm sorry to hear that. As a flower lover myself, I sympathize. Well, the thing is, I want to make a flower crown. Mom used to make them for us all the time. So I wanted to give it a try, but with all the monsters, I didn't know how I could. Here's an idea. Maybe we could do the picking for you? Sure. Cloud? Thoughts? What happened to your parents? Ask your brother. We'll take the job. Really? You will? The flowers grow on a hill that's got a great view of Midgar. It's kind of far, but a chocobo will get you there quick. Thank you so much. Okay. Head to the Wildflower Plateau. That is very far. It's 2,000 meters away. Okay. So what I'm thinking of doing, just to give you guys a plan... Or like an, an idea of what my plan is here. We are gonna go here, 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 and here. Then here, since I've already been there, technically. We're gonna get this tower lit up. And then we're gonna head back to here to get jobs. Because we need money. So, that's the plan. Are we able to pick up stuff while we're on the chocobo? We can. That is way nicer. Who the heck is the bird? What is this bird? Why am I following this bird? This bird is in... What? Where is this bird taking us? 
I'm following this bird now, and I don't know why. Oh. I have found... Look at that! You've stumbled upon a life spring. Why don't you try scanning it? See what you uncover. Accessing the planet's figurative database should help us learn about the area. Life Springs. Surveying Life Springs grants the wisdoms of the life stream, revealing new points of interest. Following a spring seeker owl will lead you to the life spring, its natural habitat. That be a life stream. How do I dismount? Oh. There's so much stuff here. I just got a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, it's a mini game. Oh. What if I had not done it well? New region intel. Surveying life springs allow you to decipher the knowledge of the life stream, revealing regional intel. Press that. Okay. Confirmed. Data received. Life springs such as this can be discovered in every region. Their potential energy output is far too minuscule for Shinra to exploit. But to us, they're fonts of intel. I encourage you to seek out more of these life springs. Interesting. Region intel. Oh, so it gives you a history of everything that's happened here. Kind of. For the grasslands. So, okay, so this gives you a history of Calm. So this tells you what Calm is about. This humble town serves as a transport hub for the grasslands, hence the distinctive Bailey built from the monitoring Bailey built for the monitoring of commercial and private traffic. During the war with the Republic of Junon, Shinra saw fit to occupy Calm due to its stout fortifications and strategic value, and it has remained under company control ever since. As it lacks a reactor of its own, Calm is a reliant on Midgar and its pipelines for a steady supply of Mako, which is stored in a large tank for regulated use. This arrangement allows the residents to enjoy both modern conveniences and a healthy environment, a combination that has attracted many new residents of late. Ten years ago, a significant portion of the town was damaged through though Shinra quickly intervened and carried out a comprehensive reconstruction effort. Details regarding the incident and the extent of the destructions are sparse. Oh. So something happened there. Alright, so we did that. Now there's something here. It's a fiend. Okay, so this is a fiend battle. Now it should be spawned here. Combat assignments. Alert! Alert! Dangerous fiend detected in your vicinity. Please ensure you are prepared before engaging. <laughs> My sensors are picking up some understandable confusion. It's a pleasure to meet you, Cloud. I am your personal monster assessment instrument. But since that's a mouthful, you can call me Mai. Chadley programmed me to assist you by providing detailed analyses of the fiends you encounter. I hope I can be of service to you in the many battles ahead. With that out of the way, I'm picking up unusual fiend activity nearby. To procure the biological data that we require, you'll need to complete specific objectives during combat. But don't worry, because I'll be here to help you succeed. Good luck! I have to do certain things during combat? You cannot flee from these battles? Dangerous fiends may be in the vicinity. Pressure an enemy, stagger an enemy, and avoid being poisoned. Oh, Rare they're challenges. Identified. Commencing guidance protocol. The pungent odor that these fiends release is so that their population has exploded. Uh, fire. Yes. I got poisoned. 
How? Let's switch it up. How do I get it pressure? It's your turn. I can't get it pressured. Got a stagger. Well fought. Though perhaps you could polish off those objectives next time. Ah, uh, can I do it again? Retry. Spells. Blizzard. Go. There it is. They all died. All done. Cool. All right, so that is that one. So now we got to go up there. Phenomenon Intel Coastal Lockout. Let's call our Chocobo. Oh man, I am gonna be stuck playing this game forever and ever because of all of the side stuff and the challenges. This is gonna be so much fun. Hey, Cloud. Do you notice any sparkling minerals nearby? Yes. These are known as guide stones. Crystals that direct travelers to shrines to the divine. The stones emit light when they shatter, producing an illuminated path. If ever you're lost, try smashing one. Following the light should lead you to a sanctuary set to honor the tutelary deity of a given region. The shrines contain untold divine knowledge, slumbering within massive crystals. I can use this knowledge to strengthen your summoning materia, so I encourage you to seek out said sanctuaries. Oh, this is the what I need for the Titan. Hold on. So if I destroy these and follow, follow this. Ones are home to Titan sanctuaries. In the Age of Myths, when Titan rose from his subterranean prison, he created a massive earthquake. Thus did a vast swath of land rise from the oh. sea, becoming the grasslands. Okay, I gotta go down here. Wait, there's another one. There was something over here. I, this is the only path I didn't go when I was exploring this area before. There's a cave down here. Whoa. Alpha. Sanctuaries contain the crystallized knowledge of summons, which will strengthen your summoning materia. Got it. This is positively incredible, Cloud. I can't recall ever seeing a crystal of this caliber before. To think the secrets of the divine dwell within. I cannot wait to see what sort of intel our analysis will yield. You'll need to synchronize with the crystal before I can extract data on the deiform entity. I'm counting on you. Examining a summon crystal will reveal its memory matrix. A series of points that will appear in order and you must memorize their positions in necessary timing. Yes. How... I have to memorize? I may fail this. X. What the heck? Commence. Oh. Input air. Oh, dude. Wait, so. Okay, do it again. Commence. Did I do it? I did it. A 
analysis complete. I managed to extract the necessary data from the crystal. This should allow me to strengthen your materia. Hey, let's go. All right. Now there is the church at the edge of this hill. These guys. What did you find? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? These guys are here. I would too. And it looks like crap. But it's definitely pulsing with a ridiculous amount of power. Once we flip it, we'll be swimming in lakes of gill. Hey, Cloud. Isn't that... Like you've forgotten Vex badasses. <laughs> yeah, you won't sit to our home and beat us to shit. We haven't done nothing. <laughs> you big jerks. You're responsible for the destruction of our charitable organization. Oh, are we? News to me. What are you doing here? <laughs> Midgar isn't big enough for us. We're taking our operations worldwide. We've gone legit. We're a business now. Mm. They're a special kind of stupid. If Shinra can take over the world with Mako, then all we gotta do is find our own treasures, and then we'll be on top. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna appreciate all the things. Hand it over now. Let's get this over with. Now you're after our treasure? Well, sucks to be you. We found it. Yeah, we're the only ones who can appreciate it. Hand it over. Now. Ha! You really think that's enough to intimidate the lights? No, please, it's all yours. Just don't hurt us again. Wait, Dad! Wait, Dad! We're freaking out! Now listen here, num nuts. I got a foolproof plan. I call it Use a decoy! So who's the decoy? All of you! That's who! Wait. Gentlemen, it has been an honor! It is a surprise! Meet back at the hideout! <laughs> oh, wow. Decoys are dead! Hey, Coming through. through. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Abilities do looking for me? Feeling can you take over for me? Going in. Are you okay? Ow. Alright, he's down. He dead. A bottle of adrenaline. Cloud. My readings indicate the proto relic is on the move. Would you mind updating me on the situation? Bandits beat us to it. Oh, I see. Fortunately, I've already ascertained the proto relic's destination. Would you mind heading there? To the hideout.
The pipeline management facility. It's way over there. Okay, so that is taken care of. There is this one right here. So we gotta go this way. The seaboard tower, we made it. But there are some enemies here. We gotta clear it out. They're nothing. kind of overkill. I just wanted to see what it looked like and it did the it did the job. Never in doubt. Now let's activate this. Activated another beast encounter. Alright, hold on. There's something up here if I can climb this. Maybe some chests? Maybe? Anything? We got some Shenra boxes. A Moogle metal. Yeah, we're going the right way, right? Okay, that's what. Just making sure. Bear of Grudges. Oh, oh stagger, defeat all enemies. Man, this is easy. These guys are easy. disposition of the led to its widespread adoption as a beast of burden. Applications included agriculture, transportation, and even Various beasts, however, were valued as a for arts and crafts. Unfortunately, they are in the toilet. The remaining wild alpha dumps found here in the ground. Most are Most are Especially these ones. Which is why we must study them thoroughly before they become a threat to animals or humans. Keep it together. <laughs> so I'm cheering for you. He's pressured. I just need you to get. Staggered. Oh, why don't you? I got this. Ah, uh, yay! Here we go. Let's get this. Ow, dude, they got way more health. Uh, abilities. You're dead. Get him! Wow, ah. I almost feel sorry for that. I got a proficient. Ow, Jesus! Let me teach him a lesson. Uh, I don't know what you could do. Are you okay? Uh, items, spells, cure yourself. Oh, I thought you were dead. Ow. Fire. Now, after you. Three is all you ready? Here goes. Summon! Do it, Shiva! You willing to step up for us? She has Shiva's ability? Summon's ability. Summon's fight alongside you for a brief period and the remaining time is indicated by their gradually decreasing gauge. Oh, you need to heal yourself. Oh, Cloud is down. Oh, I don't know. 
I'm not gonna get this. I barely got that down. Oh. I got that within the time limit. With barely a second. Oh, dude, that was rough. That was a very impressive battle just now. Well done. Based on the battle data you provided, I was able to generate a new virtual combat trial. Oh, and I helped too. Feel free to try it whenever the mood takes you. Go on. Jeez. Oi, man, that was... That was brutal. What is that? A Moogle Intel. I'm gonna fast travel to here. Yes, how fast is the fast travel? Really fast. Okay, what is Moogle Intel? Prairie Moogle. Pop inside a mushroom-shaped moog stool to get a peek at the lives of the fantastical creatures who dwell is therein. Is that a mushroom? Mog? Yes. What the? Welcome to our Moogle Emporium. Okay. Though, I'm sorry to say we aren't open quite yet, and I'm not even sure when we will be. <laughs> Those Mooglets are refusing to come back, and we can't do business without them, Kubo. Actually, Maybe you wouldn't mind helping? The Mooglets are having too much fun to come back on their own, so I want you to round them up. And then we can open up the Emporium, and everyone will be happy, Kubo! Uh, yeah. Fine. I'll see what I can do. Assist the Moogle Merchant. Uh, chase the Mooglets around the field to lure them back to their mug stool. Catch them and escort them there yourself. Or catch them. Bring all five Moogles back to their mug stool. Okay. Round up the Mooglets. How do I catch them? Oh, I got one. Where's yours? I got it and I don't even know where yours is. Does it go by the color? Okay. I gotta avoid the bombs. Okay. Mosh. You got wind abilities. Alright, one more. Moki. He's got bananas. <laughs> They're done. You're a lifesaver, Koopo. Kubo, now we can finally open the Emporium! Here you can exchange Moogle medals for cool stuff we found lying around. Everything's great, I promise! I do have some of those. Trade. You, I have, how many do I have? I have three. So I can do it with Ether, a Ruby, can be found in Rabbit Burrows, and an Emerald. I don't even know what that, but I don't have enough. And then, Art of Swordplay, and 
Way of the fists. I need six of those. Okay. Just so you know, there are six more mock stools out there, Koopo. So be sure to say hi to my friends if you find one. Also, the more emporiums we open up, the more stuff we'll have for you to buy. That's a win-win situation in my books, Koopo. Done. We haven't even done half of the stuff in this region yet. We've done all of this, though. Alright, so we gotta get to here. I can't fast travel there, but we can fast travel to here. Yes. Oliver's farm. And then there should be a tower right here. There it is. Hello! Go on! Ow. Ow, I thought I... You're up! Howling Smash! Let's finish this! Snow Flurry! This one's for you! See you around! Alright, we got some new abilities! What did this reveal? Ooh. We're almost at a hundred. Wailing weed. Fiend. Prevent enemies from using quick nap. Stagger. Enemy and defeat all enemies when the time. It may look like nothing more than a weed Staggered. Go for it. Uh, let's see. Uh, spells. Blizzard. Go. Spectacular. Tagging out. Wow. He used quick nap. Oh, I gotta interrupt them. Fire does a lot of damage. I should be. Prevent them. In, okay, so I should use fire against those guys. They, that is absolutely their weakness. We did it. Nice. Better them from using quick nap. Nice. Okay, then there's a, a well here. All right, here we go. Oh, I mistimed it. There we go. It just makes you redo it. We're over a hundred. Our second life spring data. Cloud, by analyzing the life spring data, I was able to locate an old Republic transmitter chip. This chip likely contains an exceptionally rare formula. I okay. recommend searching for it. Where? New excavation site located. Where is it? Oh, I'm right next to it. Bygone settlement. Hey, Cloud. It seems that a transmitter chip is buried nearby. You should be able to sniff it out with the aid of a chocobo. Once you pinpoint its location, you can ask your bird to dig it up. With that, let the treasure hunt begin. Okay. Unless you're dying to do the legwork, let a bird find the chip. I 
I'm gonna say it's right here. <laughs> but I'll call the chocobo. Oh, there's three artifacts here. Okay, there's one right here. You can now transmute a windmill gear. That's quite the transmuter chip you found. In fact, it was once used in the construction of windmills. Given its rarity, I would not be surprised if someone had need of such technology. No, the town needs something to fix their windmills. Enhanced Copper Bracer! Okay, we got an armor upgrade. And a wood sprite armlet. Last one! A cushion. We can now transmute cushions instead of having to spend money. Nice. Okay. Now... That is that. There is a phenomenon here. Uh, okay, so we gotta go follow the road. This road's seen better days. Much of the Republic's infrastructure has fallen into disrepair after years of neglect. And you know damn well Shinra ain't about to spend a single gill on shit they don't use. Is it true the Republic used to run buses between towns? Yes, though that service ended when the war did. In other words, we gotta hoof it, cause Shinra's run by tightwads. Well, I don't mind. It's kind of fun exploring the great outdoors. You do you. So we found the second... Cloud, I've picked up readings from the... Proto Relic. I believe the bandits are close by. And busy preparing a meal, if I'm not mistaken. They may flee if openly confronted. I suggest using those shipping containers to cover your approach. Oh, we have to sneak around? <laughs> Aerith is just running in there, though. Dude, this dude... Oh, I was gonna say, his arms are crazy. Oh, so we gotta sneak in there. It's another sneaking situation. Infiltrating a hideout. Take cover behind shipping containers to reach the room undetected. Sneak past Beck's badasses to reach the warehouse. Did you ditch us like that, boss? Don't be an idiot. I had to for the treasure. Obviously. I was inconsolable. I'm a likely seer guy myself. What's that? Oh, it's like when you're uh, consolable. But not. Oh, I get Better it. be enough for us, too. You think that Mike's gonna come after us? Okay, we'll hide oh, out here. Smells until like that heaven. Gives up. Hey, boss. Hey, I need you to turn around. I'm hungry. You ain't ready yet, dingus. I'm starving we over call here. It well done, cause shit's gotta get done well, not poorly. Yeah, but when does he turn around? Too well. Hey, are you a chef? You're gonna share. You got a puppy hat. <laughs> oh, I swear no. I saw something move. No, you didn't. You didn't see crap. Okay, we'll hide out here till that merc gives up. That is. Did I make it? <laughs> if that's not well done, I don't know what is. Presenting the finest food you'll uh, ever eat. Great fucking bird! Oh. <laughs> Turned out pretty good if I do say so myself. Okay, boys, time to shout it! Find a way into the building? Oh, it's locked. Door's locked, so I gotta find another way. Oh, I found it. It's right here. Okay. 
Apparently that door is locked as well. Otherwise, there would not be a ladder right here. Howdy, folks. So, you want this thing that bad, huh? Whoa. Yes. <laughs> Way you came after us, I figured. <laughs> Which means I was right all along. This thing's worth a fortune. So we ain't just gonna give it up, dumbass. I don't have time for this. Just the word now, Buzz. Relax, boys. I've got just the plan. I call it bait in the hook. Yeah, hook in the bait. <laughs> What's the bait? For all intensive purposes, it's you. <laughs> Me? Here, take this. Thanks. Can I eat it? <laughs> Tuck it for the getcha! <laughs> what is that bird? <laughs> he beefed up? Defeat the bait? He's... He's... Okay, he's got attack up. Uh, abilities... Jesus! Yeah, Butch is down. I mastered the firebolt ability. And... That was it. <laughs> hey. So, um, Cloud, the proto relic does not appear to be at your location. Whatever. You can track it, can't you? I most certainly can. Not only that, I've deduced where the bandits are headed next. And on that note, I'll let you get back to it. Okay. We're almost halfway. Proto relic geo information revealed. Oh, it's farther in. Is there anything else in here? Doesn't seem to be the case. So. Wow, man, this place is like this area is just insane. We have four side quests, three card games, and then two more Proto Relic stuffs. It seems like this Proto Relic, the side quests, and then the cards are the main focus. Wastelands Tower. Any enemies? There is. Let us through, or else. I've never seen that bird in my life. What? Ow, I almost got it. Abilities. Snow flurry. Let's finish this. Abilities. Frost blow. Gold. One more shot. Uh, spells. Cure yourself. Ow. That wasn't so bad. Alright, they're dead. Oh, that was a little rough. Alright. All right, let's get this revealed. See what's near here. Never seen that. 140. Ooh. 
Ooh. Ooh. Oh, the bird. Bird. Don't worry. I'm following the bird. Dun, dun, dun. Is this it? <gasps> the cavern life spring. Oh, so much stuff. Oh, we got a ruby. Whoops. We're at 150. New region, flora and fauna of the grasslands. So we learn about the flowers and the lands. Region Intel, number two. In stark contrast to the barren Mako ravaged outskirts of Midgar, the ecosystem of the grasslands remains relatively unscathed. Streams flowing from certain mountain range nourish the lush meadows below. Vast wetlands make up much of the southern region. In days past, boats and chocobo carriages were a common sight, but as most goods are now transported by sea or air, traffic through the wetlands has steadily decreased. Moreover, as an immense man-eating serpent dubbed Midgard Summer has been sighted in the area of late, few dare to brave the old trails. Even those capable of evading the gargantuan snake may yet fall victim to one of the many inescapable quagmires. Whoa. Okay. We're learning more about this area. Um... Okay, there is something over here. It is a divine intel area. Smash it! <laughs> Following the... Where'd it go? According to local legends, Titan possesses earth-shattering strength. He is capable of crushing whole mountains with his fists. Perhaps we have him to thank for the rolling hills and verdant plains that comprise this region of the planet. So this is the third one. I'm I skipped B. I I'm missing one more. Yes. Let's see if we can do this. Memory. Okay, squares. It's nothing but squares. Okay. It's kind of just tap like tap. Let's go. Yeah, easy. We got one more to go. So it seems like 300 is the number to get. I was able to successfully extract data on the deity. You're welcome. All right, so we got this. So we got we got a fiend intel over here. So let's go over there and then deal with those bandits again. Oh, is it up on the bridge? Voltaic uh, canine. Pressure and it default on him. Okay. Rare grasslands wolf variant identified. Commencing guidance protocol. See the way that its mane stands on end? The electricity coursing through its body. Oh, there it is. Its hair upright. Spells. Nope. Ow. Spells. Blizzard. Go. How are you? What is your weakness? Arrow. Go. Not that one. Fire? No. It's not fire either. You got it under control. This one's for you. I, 
I never got the pressure down though. I gotta get the pressure though. I I didn't get pressure. There we go. Done. Finally. Oi. So Bio puts like a little bomb on their head and then it goes off after a little bit. Okay. That's taken care of. Uh, next up is this one. How do we get inside? Oh, right here. Hey, what you do with the hideout key? <laughs> Buried it underground so nobody could find it. You idiot! What if some good for nothing thugs break in and we get locked out? <laughs> Where'd you come from? <laughs> I won the trouble and hand it over. Not the trouble, anything but that. Just do what he says, boss. Cool it. I've still got a trick up my sleeve. A trick I like to call diversionary tactics. Okay, you know what to do. Okay? Oh, they. One of them has the item. Uh, no. It's you. You're... It's me? Uh, I... You see? You can see the sparkles behind your back. <laughs> Ta-da! Me, me, me! Look at these chumps. My tactics got them totally divergent. <laughs> so, uh, what do we do now, boss? Is it an obvious? We make a run for it! Wait a sec, boss. What about the key? Defeat the bandits. I got Ow. All good. Spells, abilities, triple slash. Oh, we're all level 20. I want them to get away. That's the plan. Once they lead us to their hideout, then we hit them. I'm sorry to have ever doubted you. Before you resume oh. your hunt, however, I'll need you to unearth the key there. It shouldn't be too tough if you have a chocobo. Okay. So, I think I'm getting a lot of money doing all this, by the way. Like, how much skill do I have? 5,000. Yeah, we've, we've got some money. Uh, sniff the air. Yep, got it. Alright. Sniff the air. Is that the key? Vex Badass's hideout. Looks like you found the key. Great. And in other news, the bandits have stopped running. Let's hope that the fourth time will be the proverbial charm. I sure hope so. The hideout is the last one. And it is located up from the town. So we have to head back to town. Oh man, even I need a breather after all that. That was a lot of stuff. Three side quests here. Everyone, Lifeline and peril. I thought you were here to fix them. <laughs> uh, never mind. Yeah, we're more like demolition experts. So unless you want us to blow something up. How can you make jokes at a time like this? It's downright distasteful. Uh, anyway, what's going on? It's the Mako pipeline. It sprung a leak. I paid a wandering merc to patch the thing up. I certainly wasn't about to fiddle with critical infrastructure as a layman. Though I thought I'd hear back from them by now. A merc? Yep. Some hotshot from Midgard's Undercity. Or so they claim. Sounds like a pro we ought to get to know. Oh, you'd like to meet them? Well, if you're that keen, would you mind delivering a message for me while you're at it? Uh, ask about this Merc. Our town technician's laid up in bed at the moment, recovering from a fiend attack. We asked Shinra to send someone to fill in, anyone who knows the work, but we haven't heard back. Fortunately for us, that mercenary rolled into town. Without him, we would have been up a creek. 
Sure. Let's take the job. Capital. Oh, I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm Fritz Bellinger, the mayor here. I'm sure that mercenary is hard at work over at the warehouse outside of town. Mind asking them to give us an update on the repairs? A simple, it's coming along, would suffice. We are working as hard as we can to get the power of back online. I think you're the only one who made a name for themselves in the undersea. And here is the board. Talking about? Nope. Not a clue. A rare card lost. Lifeline in peril, and then livestock's bane. So that must be all of the side quests that this area had to offer. Right, because they're they're no longer in here. Oh, I know there's one down below. The bartender's request. Uh, track this, yeah. There you are. Hey, how you doing? Hmm? What? Hey, mister. You a winner? Some say. Awesome. That's good enough for me. The name's Vash, and I could really use your help. Truth is, I bungled a Queen's Blood match. Hard. So, not only did my ego take a licking, but I lost a card near and dear to my heart. What I'm getting at is, I think you'd be able to win it back for me. Uh, we'll take the job. I gotta play this game anyway. I gotta do that mini game. But first, I gotta make sure I'm putting my baby's fate in the right hands. Mind if we go around? Oh. Okay. I'm pretty sure this thing is basically done. I can't. Nothing I can do here. I won? Is it because I had two lanes and he only took one? Okay, that's the kind of skill I'm talking about. You'll beat Virgil no prop. That's the guy you gotta play. The one who took my card. He works at the clock tower. Mind kicking his ass for me? And when you're done, come straight back. I'll have a special cocktail waiting with your name on it. Got this great recipe I've been itching to try again. Information which leads to an arrest is subject okay. to Okay. So I gotta speak to Vigil. Where, he said he's by the clock tower. There you are. Oh, care for a match? I what am ready. The card you took from the bartender. Ah, the card. So Vash has resorted to this, hiring people to win its games for him. Here we go. Fine. But word of warning, I'm not a pushover like some folks. He's number two. Yes. All right, let's go. Come on. Ugh, cracking my neck. I think I won. It's a wrap. He got a nine, but I got an eight. I win. Finally. Jeez. Ah, damn. I really lost? It was one hell of a match, though. Am I right? You and I are definitely gonna have to play again sometime. But, uh, not today. Gotta run. Hold it. Aren't we forgetting something? <laughs> right, the card. The one I won off Fash, right? Oh, shoot. Which card was that again? Oh, crap, I remember. The Chocobo and Moogle one. So, this is kind of awkward, but I don't have it anymore. Is that so? No, seriously. I, I flipped it. I was on my last gill, so I had to sell it to a card collector. A guy named Thorin. He runs this card shop outside of town. Wow. Maybe check with him? A I know exactly where that is. Am I right? Okay. I'm pretty sure that's it for the town. Okay, so there is... Businessman's Hideout. It's probably this. Is 
this probably takes you to the hideout of the gang. Let's get this over with. All right, the final area, Intel 4. That's the building. At one point, it was used for the storage of Shinra property, but the bandits have since turned it into a hideout and probably filled it with traps. Uh-oh. Oh, it's one of those... What? Hey, boss. I don't get it. Why are we playing dead in the hideout? Obviously, so we can pull one over on the mark, dumbass. Pull one over while dead. Try to Wake up the dead businessmen. Uh, well, that box could probably just collapse. Figuring defenseless corpses, you should be ashamed! Corpses, huh? Now listen, what I'm trying to say here is, we don't gotta resort to violence. We can talk things out, like gentlemen. Well, I'm trying to be nice. You walk all over me. You know what I think? You people are the real thieves. Bunch of scumbags. Real fullbacks. Fullbacks, huh? Try to keep it peaceful. <laughs> you guys mess with the wrong legitimate. Yeah. I forgot what these things are weak to. <laughs> Ow. I think it's fire. Calling fire. Do it. Uh, I need you to use an item. All right, assess. Hold on. It's a oh. Okay, electric stuff. I don't have any electric abilities, unfortunately. Not looking good. Ready. Chocobo and Moogle summon. Go! <laughs> I don't know what this is gonna look like. Oh. Okay. Oh, he just healed me. Oh, cause Cloud died. Spells. Do I have a Phoenix down? I do on Cloud. Yeah, get him back up. That's it. You've got this. All right. Let's switch it up. Uh, let's see. Let's do fire blood. Go. And it's dead. Jeez. Modded sweeper. That was pretty, pretty sloppy there. Come on, you gotta let us off the hook. Off the hook. Off the hook. Off the off the hook. Off. 
All we wanted was to sell the treasure for some cash so we could stop stealing and start fresh! <laughs> it's always been our dream to start a company and do all this work! Hey, we could throw him a bone. 2,000 gil. Yeah! <laughs> 2,000 gil. Hey, 2,000 gil. No. And here I thought you wanted this thing. We're washing our hands of the crap. Oh, we have to. Okay, I didn't know if something would change. yet? I do. I didn't know it was a pleasure doing business. See that, boys? That's how you broker an honest I didn't know if no would provide a different response. No more bandit stuff. You better believe it. From now on, we're earning our money the honest way. As a business. Next business, baby. Next business. Let's talk corporate structure. I'm president, and you're my employee. Employees? <laughs> oh, I'm employees. Works employees. Wait, what's a employee do anyway? Be a buddy. Work as a servant. Act as family. Uh, act as family. Oh, family! <laughs> I always wanted one of those. All right, boys. We got work to do. There's huh? glittering riches out there, and your president's gonna lead you to it. Let's miss this. Yes, sir, Mr. Press. To the press. So, you think they've turned over a new leaf? Who knows? What did we get? Yeah, what is that? Bex Proto Relic. What the heck was that? That was a talking giant sa samurai armors robot. Cloud, I have confirmed that you are now in possession of the proto relic. I've already taken the liberty of scanning it and need only analyze the data. Should I happen to pick up other proto relic readings, I may request your assistance again. Oh, there is one more thing I should mention. Your device detected a small amount of interference. I can't say for certain, but it's entirely possible that others are looking for proto relics as well. What for? Oh. That's what I hope to find out. I'll be in touch if I learn anything new. Nice! Grasslands! Bex proto relic complete! Jeez. Alright, guys! That is it for this. We completed one of the major goals here. So we still have more to explore in this region. We actually have to cross the swamp with our chocobo. That is the main scenario. But there is still so much stuff that we can do here up in the northern portions of here. There's multiple quests here. So what I am going to do is I'm going to complete these side quests. I've already kind of been to these areas. We're going to get some of this activation still doing. I'm trying to complete this top half of the map here before we proceed farther down and then do the main scenario. We're almost there. We've done like three quarters of the uh, intel gathered of this area. The fact that they have this intel gathering stuff just makes me want to 100 percent it. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but those dots need to get filled up. So... Yeah, expect a lot of long videos for this game, for sure. 
and then I'll try my best to make it as entertaining as possible for you guys. But we are still very early on in this game. I want to thank you guys again for watching this one, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Peace.